Surveillance video shows the suspects moving quickly through the store, pushing some bikes out of the way and wheeling off with others. Altogether, they were in and out in about five minutes. They came in through the front window. Uh, they had to move a lot of the stuff out of the way. They had to beat bars off the windows. The video is from Mike Johnston's shop, Ellicott City Motorsports, at 630 Saturday morning. According to police, the suspects are three 16-year-olds and a 15-year-old, all juveniles who, according to Mike, worked like professionals, contributing to a dirt bike theft problem that he calls an epidemic. This was the second hit on his shop in the past 10 days. Right now, currently, they've hit three dealers five times in the last 10 days. All of these bikes that are getting stolen are ending up on the city streets. Police were already on their way while they say the teens loaded five dirt bikes into this white van parked down the road, then led officers on a pursuit for several miles until they crashed the van into a shopping center sign and then got out and ran. Police arrested them a short time later. They say all the teens are from Baltimore and the van was stolen. They're just working against us. Mike's upset about the stolen bikes and the damage, but even more so about a system that he he thinks desperately needs to be fixed. At 16 years old, they know nothing is going to happen to them. You know, the, the system's broken and we need to change it. They, they shouldn't be allowed to do whatever they want because they're under 18 years old. Somebody's got to be responsible, either them or their parents. The police are not releasing the teenagers names. They say they are investigating the possibility that they're responsible for other dirt bike thefts. Reporting in Howard County tonight, Kyrie WBAL TV 11 News.